What's up everybody, this is Bruce, aka Geektacular, and today I've got another unboxing for you. Today I'm going to be unboxing the brand new uh, J-Hope solo album release, which is titled Jack in the Box. Um, this is the first solo release of kind of the new uh, solo era of BTS here. So you know that, you know, as these come out, I gotta pick these up too, um, to go along with all of my... OT7 uh, <laughs> BTS stuff, so definitely have to support J-Hope here, and planning on picking up all the other ones when they come out too. So you might notice this is a very, like, small release <laughs> compared to usually what you'd expect if you buy, like, a BTS album or something like that. Um, that's because this came out exclusively um, as a Weverse album. So Weverse, which is, like, a social media site for, like, K-pop entertainment stuff um it's like an app uh, it's a whole like social media platform but um they're the ones who sell um who sell directly from the record labels uh all the bts and txt and, and hyphen sort of stuff um but anyway they have a new app called Weverse Albums, which is basically like a digital music app, but it's got a bunch of like kind of extra un digital unlockable stuff. Um, so it's not just the music, like you can listen to the whole album on there um, once you buy it, but it also unlocks some other like digital photos and stuff like that that kind of go along with the album. So they have a whole app. And what they're doing is they're starting now to sell basically a code to unlock this album in the app plus a couple of extra little physical things. So they save money because it's not like a giant thing. There's no CDs um, or anything like that. So they don't need a gigantic package. Um, so for this one, they just went with basically sort of a really cool looking uh, sort of card holder. And then I think there's like a photo card or two in here along with the actual unlock code for the app. So that's what this is. This is a um, Weaver's um uh, order bonus which is I, it's some kind of like um some kind of photo card hologram thing so i'm going to take a look at this first i don't know if this is random or if everybody gets the exact same one but you can only basically you can only order this directly from weavers if you get it anywhere else um they just got it from weavers and they're reselling it so um, I think, you know, these all come originally from Weavers, and so if you order it there, it's like 10 bucks or something, I think. Um, you do get a bonus here, so let me go ahead and open this up. And I'll show you the Weavers bonus first. Yeah, so see, this says Weavers Shop on it, so it's basically their kind of like, um, their little bonus thing here. So this is really cool. So this is kind of like, it's like this clear plastic, and it's sort of um, sort of uh, bound together at the bottom there. You can kind of see through it. And then inside of there are two different cards. So they're like kind of static uh, stuck together, but basically there's one really cool like foil photo card of J-Hope right here. And then see the back there and then here's a clear photo card that kind of goes on top of it as you can see that there it's literally like clear plastic this is kind of more like a paper sort of like standard um, photo card here but you go like this and it gives it kind of a really cool effect and you can place it right in this little holder here and just kind of gives a cool sort of like um, framed photo sort of look. So yeah, that is very cool there. So yeah, that's really cool. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this back in the sleeve here. Like so. so yeah, that's a cool extra little bonus um, photo card thing there. So there's that. And then here is kind of the main album here. So if you buy the album, this is what you're buying. You're not buying a CD. You're not buying a, a giant box set with a giant photo book and stuff. So if you buy the album, just know that this is kind of what you can expect. It just sh it ships in just like a little bubble mailer because it's so light um, and so flat. 
which is totally fine. It came, it came in uh, pretty good condition, so that's fine. It does come in this little protective thing, which I like. So yeah, it's definitely different. Um, I was kind of hoping that they had sort of a full, like a uh, full album, uh, CD and book sort of thing like they usually do. But you know, if this is if this is kind of the main product they're putting out for it, the main way to unlock the album and sell the album, then I'm totally fine with that. I don't need it to be on CD necessarily or anything. It's nice to have, but. Um, you know, if this is how they're kind of doing all the solo stuff, then I'm totally fine with this because this is a cool little collectible. Um, so you can kind of see some of the cards sort of poking out here, but I think this whole thing unfolds. So it kind of has a 3D appearance like it's a cube, which is really cool. It's kind of trippy. It looks sort of weird on the camera, but as you can see, it's totally flat. So it's just an optical illusion. It just looks like that. But like when you look at it like this, I mean, it's very convincing. It, it, it looks like a real, uh, a real cube. So that's, that's pretty cool. A cool play on the Jack in the Box theme. So this says pull out right here. So I'm going to do what it says. I'm going to pull it out. And then it opens up like this. Oh, that's neat. And then bam, it opens up like this. I guess that's uh, J-Hope's kind of facsimile signature right there. It's not real, it's just like kind of printed on there, but it's still very cool. You open that up. Oh man, so that's cool. I'm gonna have to remember how this goes. <laughs> I've already forgotten. <laughs> the. Uh, I guess it only really works one way. I guess this part and then this part and then this part sort of folds up and under, yeah. All right. And then so there are some, there's like some text inside. Like this says, welcome, it's your box, enjoy. Which is cool. I'm not sure what all this um, Korean says. I'll have to like translate it or something uh, later. But so that flap just says "Welcome, enjoy." This one has his signature. This one just says uh, "Platform developed by Weavers." And then it does have two little tabs right here, which kind of hold in all the goodies. So those are kind of in there. And Jack in the Box and J Hope there. This is what the back looks like. So what a weird, cool little design. So in there we have two foil stickers. They both say Jack in the Box. One's like square and then one's sort of uh, rectangular. So two little stickers there that you can put on something if you want, which is really cool. Then you get photo card number one. Then you get photo card Number two, so one has like a, one has like a uh, black and white back. The first one has like a black and white back. The other one has like a blue and black backing. So I assume these are probably random, kind of standard photo card uh, quality and, um, and shape and everything there. And so you get two, two cards with codes on them. So this one is um, unlocks a survey. If you fill out the survey in Weverse, you can get Weverse shop cash and um, special emblems for your Weverse account. So those are things you can actually uh, use on your profile in Weverse. Sometimes these don't work in the US. It kind of depends. So um, uh, you know, obviously, I'm going to try to try to use it. Sometimes these are just for like uh, Korean. Uh, usage or Japanese or whatever. Sometimes they don't work in the USA, but it will definitely give it a try. And then the other card that's in here, the back of that one's just blank. And then the other card that's in here is the actual Weverse album code. So this is what you actually scan into the Weverse albums app on your phone. And this will unlock the whole album digitally in Weaver's albums. And like I said, it unlocks the digital album. I think you can download it too and stuff like that. Um, it's basically just like buying the digital album. Uh, plus, I think it unlocks some other digital stuff like photos, um, artwork, I mean, lyrics and stuff, that sort of thing, all digitally in the app. So yeah, a, kind of a cool idea. So you get a QR code with that and these are kind of the instructions on the backside. Um, so there's a feature of the actual app where you go in, you can add an album, 
and then it lets you scan a QR code which is on the other side and then it unlocks it in your account and that's it so yeah very cool um, kind of different sort of setup they've never really released something like this before I think um, the new in hyphen um, release also maybe had one of these two they're starting to basically there's only a, a couple of albums available there right now on Weverse albums but they're starting to um, release some of their newer releases on there so yeah um, kind of a cool concept um, I do sort of like the big uh, album box sets with you know the photo book and the CD and all that stuff I do kind of still like that I kind of prefer that but um, if it was between this and just not having a physical release, then yeah, obviously I would take this uh, any day of the week. Um, you know, you do still get something you can kind of put in your collection, put on your shelf, that sort of thing. So you do still get that. Um, but you go, you also get the convenience of not having to find a spot for like a gigantic, um, a gigantic uh, box and all that stuff. So there are some benefits to it. Uh, so let me go ahead and see if I can put this back. If I can, I think it will be pretty much a success. Yep, okay. I'm trying not to um, like bend it. Uh, yeah, you just have to be really careful when you're putting it back together. But if you do it right, which I didn't quite do it right. <laughs> it's not going back flat. What did I not do right? Uh, let's see. Everything is in there. So this goes like that. All right, this is the only way it could go. And then this basically has to go like that. And then it might just need a little bit of like finagling here. Hmm. I'll have to see exactly <laughs> what I didn't put in. Oh, I see. <laughs> the corners like slipping out of that thing which it's not supposed to be doing hmm oh there we go so yeah just be careful when you put it back together that like it what just happened to me the little corner tried to like slide out of here which is like not where it's supposed to be so that's why it wouldn't close so yeah now it's totally closed you can keep it safe in your little plastic uh bag there plus if you get it from weverse you also get an extra cool little um weaver shop uh bonus so yeah, thanks everybody for watching this. Um, if you like this unboxing, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. That would be awesome. If you like K-pop unboxings, if you want to support J-Help, BTS, if you're ARMY, MOA, Engine, anything like that, like me, um, go ahead and click subscribe and you can check out my channel. I have tons of other um, K-pop related unboxings. I have lots of other BTS, in hyphen uh, Tomorrow by Together unboxings. Um, I have a play I have playlist for all three of those. So if you just want to watch a whole bunch in a row, binge watch some and just see some of the cool stuff that they put out over the years, um, definitely check out those playlists on my channel. Uh, thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time.